Hello, and today we're going to show you how to make a train color and shape sorting activity. So as you can see, I made the best way possible um, train cards, and each card has a different shape on it. So there is a square, a triangle, a circle, and a diamond on the cards. So the first thing that we are going to do is you're going to take all of the shapes and mix them up because you want your child to get the most out of this experience, but the shapes are color coded. So the shape and the color needs to get matched with the card that it goes on. So you mix the shapes up really good and then you take one shape off. And based on the color and the shape, you'll figure out where it goes. So Ayana has what looks like a square in her hand. So she'll put a tiny bit of glue on the square and then she'll find the blue car that corresponds with the shape. So all the squares that are in that pile will go onto that car. So your child can either take all of the yellows out and put them on or you can get everything done um, on a trial basis so if they pick up a red circle next or a green diamond or a blue triangle that is what they would do and this takes up a little bit of time so it keeps them busy also once all the cars are completely filled up you can go through and count each shape so you may want to ask questions like, how many squares did you put on the yellow card? And if you have eight squares or 10 squares, then that's what number you'll count up to until your car is completely filled up. But nonetheless, it's a lengthy activity that will keep your child busy and they'll learn their shape, they'll learn their colors, it increases their fine motor skills, their one-to-one -one correspondence, and it's also a cute art activity. So let us know how you're doing at home with art activities, and hopefully you'll find this one something that you and your child have fun doing together. Bye. Hi, so right now we're going to show you how to improve hand-eye coordination and fine motor skills with the letter V and some cereal. So the first thing you need is some paper and some of your favorite cereal. We have Fruit Loops in our container. And Ayana made a V on the paper because that's the letter that we are working on this week. So she's going to take some cereal and she's going to place it on the letter V until she's finished. So as you can see, the letters go down and then they go up. This also is not harmful if <laughs> your child likes to eat. But you can choose any letter, any shape, any thing that you want to draw and have them just outline with the cereal. And she's almost finished her V. And then the next thing that I'm going to have her do is her name. 
So as you can see, her V is completely covered. And now she has her name to do. So we just continue the same thing with the name. Um, until it's finished.